Hi everyone, I'm Yu Qingzhang from Beijing Language and Culture University. I'm going to introduce our work on relationships between perceptual distinctiveness, articulatory complexity, and functional load in speech communication. To start with, let me first briefly explain the motivation behind this study. Human language is primarily used for transferring information in social environments. For this reason, languages may be structured to facilitate efficient communication. A language is an efficient communicative system if successful communication can be achieved with minimal effort on average by the sender and the receiver. Guided by the theoretical framework, we test the hypothesis that phonemic contrasts signaling more meaning distinctions have lower articulatory complexity and higher perceptual distinctiveness. In other words, if a phonemic pair is more important in a language, phonemes in this pair will be easier to articulate, thus minimizing effort on the part of the speaker. Meanwhile, this phonemic pair will be perceptually distinct, thus minimizing the likelihood of confusion on the part of the listener. But how to evaluate these three measures quantitatively? Here we calculated articulatory complexity values of English consonants based on the model proposed by Kent, which reflects the growth in model control required to articulate sound. Perceptual distinctiveness was derived from quantifying the similarity of the response distributions of two phonemes from a phoneme identification experiment. Functional load was quantified as a change in mutual information of spoken text and phoneme sequences induced by the merger of a phoneme pair. You can refer to our paper for the mathematical details. The first major finding is that functional load for each contrast increases with its perceptual distinctiveness. For example, the phoneme pair sh has high perceptual distinctiveness and the highest functional load. The phoneme pair has the lowest perceptual distinctiveness and low functional load. The second major finding is that functional load value for each contrast decreases with articulatory complexity if the phoneme requiring less articulatory effort in the contrast. For example, the three phoneme pairs with high functional load contain the phoneme u and h, which are much easier to articulate. For detailed statistical analysis, please refer to the paper. To summarize, results indicated that consistent with the predictions derived from communicative efficiency, phonological contrasts of higher perceptual distinctiveness or phonemes of less articulatory complexity do more work in identifying distinct words. Thank you for your listening.